Dory, after just the being down by 18 and having the great second quarter, just what was the biggest difference maker that allowed the Pistons to kind of pull it out down down the stretch? Um, we can't put ourselves uh, behind the eight ball like that. Um, you know, it's it's cool though. You know, we we fought back, but you know, we want to be great. We can't, you know, we can't put ourselves in the in the hole like that. And uh, like they, they shot the ball well, but they also beat us on the glass tonight. So, and I w I would say that was the reason they got this win. You talked about rebounding has been a thing even just last week. Just what changed for you guys that allowed them to be so effective and capitalize off the glass to get those second chance points? Um, and just um, as, a, as a group, we got to find ways to help each other. Um, Klatt's doing his job of protecting the room, and we got to help him. So um, I would say as a team, we got to just do our job at a, at a, at a, at a higher standard. I think second hand shit, second chance points might have been like 23 to 9 or something like that. And but it felt like they hit all threes on the joint too, man. But is how much do the inability to kind of guard your yard on the perimeter and then they're getting in the lane and kind of creating havoc in there, how much did that lead to some of those putbacks? And such? Um, it's more, um, like I said, we you know, we want class to do his job and um, sometimes they put us in a bind because we got to help him. And, uh, you know, we like you said, we we also got guard the guard our yard. You know, keep guys out of paint. And um, I feel like um, you know, you got to put two on Dern and and Stewart, and then them guards just flying in, getting getting all them little chippies around the free throw line. And I feel like they had about four or five people with two all offensive rebounds. So, and then uh, it was tough, you know, for me to you know crash too, cause. You know, they run it so, so well in transition that, you know, um, I couldn't be aggressive on the offensive glass. It seemed as if sometimes they didn't have an answer for the three-point shooting. What was opening up and what was working so well for you guys to get those looks that you can kind of take away to build off of? Um, we were just getting stops and running. And um, Dennis and Mikhail, uh Dennis Smith, too, was just, you know, finding guys, doing a good job of getting in the paint and making it um, – making shooters job easier, you know. Shout out to Lonnie, you know, uh, he was, if you hear the way he sound, he sound terrible and he went out there and played hard. And you know, great minutes from Noah, Noah played good too. So. Talk about Lonnie, for someone who's dealing with an illness, the way that he stepped up on the bench, you've seen him do it before, but just like, what does that bring to, overall to the group? Um, you know, when he came in and stopped playing, I think it gave everybody juice, you know. Um, you know, him, him coming out here, sacrificing himself, um, you know, he's saying F how you feel. You know, he's trying to get a win, and uh, sometimes that can electric, you know, the team.